to the truth Cause we are stricken ah And up here Rock City Network's coming to you backstage from Kiss My Grass 2010 Joining me uh, uh, before the gig actually Bertie Blackman, how are you? Quite good You good? I like that hat, it's, yeah, it's, it's a, a good, good vibe it's Is that yours? No, it's a stolen hat Stolen from stolen, stolen hat. That, that generally happens at a festival, doesn't it? There's plenty of stolen No, hats I didn't steal it from the festival. I stole it from Manny, who plays drums with me, who stole it from someone else, who stole it from Pi. Is that why the hat looks so big on your head? Because yeah, he needs I that just... much room to get his hair in there? Pretty much. Yeah, you pretty know, much. you fill it out, you could fit a little afro wig. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we haven't spoken to you since uh, the EG Awards. Oh, yes. Oh, and uh, and there's, there's been plenty going on since then. There has been A couple of awards, and that's all good. We don't want to talk about those because everyone's hammered you about it. But, uh, you know, moving on into the new year, what's, what's happening this year? Um, well, I, I go, I fly to London next week, yeah, yeah. and um, we're doing a bunch of promo shows over there in February. Yeah. And uh, riding, and then come back here and do a bunch of more festivals. We're playing like a million festivals. And um, then we're doing the LaRue tour. Yeah. The tour with Luru at the end now of March. Now, is that just three dates, or is that as just as many dates as you could put on? No, she's only actually playing three dates. Is it like solo. Perth, Adelaide, Melbourne, yeah, or something yeah, yeah. really it's, weird? Yeah, no, no. I looked at it. I was like, what? Because she's doing the Bacardi Express, and we're not going to promote her stuff. So no, no, whatever. no, that's fine. <laughs> if you were going to do any like you know like a train thing, you know like Festival Express, like the Grateful Dead and all those guys. Yeah, yeah. What, what, what? what who would you want to promote that? Who would I want to promote? If we were going to do like a... Okay, let's say Rock City Networks and Bodie Blackman goes on a train ride across, you know, the Garn, that thing that goes up the middle. Yeah. Who would we want to promote apart from, you know, the obvious? Um, I think... Well, we're talking about alcohol, right? Well, just anything in general, you know. Oh, uh, NASA. NASA. NASA? Let's get NASA yeah, to yeah. sponsor it. Yeah, yeah. Done. Fine. Yeah. Well, we'll, we can try. We can try and do that. Yeah, otherwise, you know, maybe like Grey Goose vodka or something. Something classy. Grey Goose is not bad. It is. That hammers you though. You look at the bottle really? and you're drunk. Yeah. Well, that's me. I don't know. Well, you must be, uh, have a low tolerance. I am wearing a pink t-shirt. <laughs> you are. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. So uh, after, after the European trip, the four days over there and, and the writing, you're just going to just focus on the writing for the second album? Yeah, we're just working on that. And, and uh, so it's that big onslaught at the start of the year and then chill out for a bit. Focus the chi? Yeah, chill out's probably not the best word. Um, because we're um, looking at doing a bunch of gigs in Europe mid-year as well. Mm -hmm. So it will be in between festivals everywhere. Well, that it's that time of the year, you know. I it think is. Christmas is in the middle of the year in Europe. It's it is. certainly not at the end. No, it's not. not Santa like Claus here. got it wrong. Yeah, they he got, got it, it totally horribly wrong. wrong. Yeah, then like even like us here, we didn't, we worked pretty much like over Christmas. So. Yeah. What are you looking at when you get to Europe? What sort of festivals do you want to hit? Obviously, you're not going to do like Donington. No, I don't even know what that is. It's like the metal rock festival. Yeah, like, not that one. No, no. All something, the good something ones. A bit, something a bit low key. Maybe like, Ibiza Rocks. <laughs> no, like you know, like something like Montro and like. Oh, Sabrina, jazz festival. Like, yeah, what? Yeah. No, it's not all jazz Montro. But they call it the Montro Jazz Festival, don't they? I don't know. Maybe that's a jazz festival in Montreux. Maybe. Oh, Montreux in France though, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. There you go. I'm, I'm, I'm out. I'm completely wrong. It's alright. I've, I've, I'm sorry. I've, I've I apologize. I apologize. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's okay. Yeah, so that, so you're really big, big focus on Europe towards the middle of the year. Yeah, because we're releasing the record Secrets and Lies there in March, and why See what not? Happens. Why not? See what happens. Why not? What about Kiss My Grass? What do you think about this festival right in the middle of the city? You can't hear it a hundred meters outside of the venue. Not a bad spot. No, it's an awesome spot. Yeah. Yeah, I'm looking forward to playing main stage as well very soon. Yeah, yeah. It'll be good. Actually, that's a hint for me to go. What's the time? Um, I think it's like maybe 20 to 7. Yeah, yeah. you got to start soon, don't you? Yeah, for Yeah, sure. I'm going to get the hell out of here. I'm going to let you have some drinks and stuff like that. If you want any more information on this lovely lady, you can go to birdieblackman.com or all the w's.myspace forward slash birdieblackman. Kissfm.com.au. Check that out as well. It's Rock City Networks from... Uh, Kiss My Grass 2010, Bertie, thank you very much for your time. It's a pleasure as always, we'll see you next time. Bye.